What's cooking good looking? Welcome back guys, your favorite trainer Kathy from Kathy Fitness. Now I'm really hoping that all my late nights at the bar have paid off. I don't even know you read that. Hopefully my camera skills are on par today. But I am a few days out from Nashville, so I'm gonna be leaving to Ottawa tomorrow, getting settled into the hotel, and then it's time to compete. So we are almost there, hoping the hard work pays off. So stay tuned. We'll head over to my hotel after the nice five and a half hour drive. Hopefully traffic isn't too bad, but let's get on with it. So we are one night out from Nationals. I am in the last day of my water load and well, I'm done the water load. Today's the water cut. So I stopped drinking after 3.30 and I won't drink any more liquids till I weigh in tomorrow at 11.30. My coach has had me sweat out a pound right now so I can get more food in. So that's the process I'm doing right now. If you're, if I'm speaking gibberish or another language, and you're unsure what I mean by the water load and water cut. I actually had another video where I covered that, so I'll link that in the description. You can watch that to get up to speed. So, just did that, got some more food in me. I'm just gonna relax for the rest of the night, wake up, weigh in, get some food, and have a good meet. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Oh man, so it is the morning of my weigh-in. So, morning of my competition, I will be weighing in too. So I'm just gonna check what I'm at at the hotel. And then when I head over to the venue, I wanna check my weight on the official scale. So, right now, whew, I am a bit lighter than expected. I'm hitting around 81.5 kilograms. So, I mean, that's good, but I want to be a bit heavier as my weight, and my weight cut off is 83 kilos. So I can get in some more food in me, so I'm going to do that, get some breakfast, head over to the venue, check my weight, and then it's competition time. Wish me luck. Let's go.
so I'm exhausted. Nationals is done. I will give you a quick recap of how everything went. And I got a pretty funny story for you guys. So give me a second. I'm going to head to the house, get settled in, and then let's wrap this up. So that's a wrap. Nationals is done in the books. I'm pretty happy with how it went, went considering it was my very first Nationals. I finished third securing the bronze medal. I was sitting in fifth before my last deadlift attempt and I hit 699.9 pounds to push it into third place. So I actually rebroke my deadlift national record which I set back at Provincials in November 2018 so I was pretty happy with that. But the funny story is, so going in one of our goals was to be the first Canadian 83 kilogram lifter to break that 700 pound barrier and so I actually thought I did with my last deadlift attempts so like I ran over to my handler asked him like I didn't even know what I was hitting I ran over asked him what do you put on the bar what place I finished so he told me 700 pounds you finished third I was ecstatic I ran over talking to my girlfriend she's like hold on the board only said 699.9 I look her over at my handler he confirms and I was just crushed a little bit because I was like really we were that close and in all fairness I can't blame him completely because it really wasn't his fault on the official CPU cards for 317.5 kilograms it actually does say 700 pounds I'll bring this a bit closer you can see that right there on their official cards they say 700 pounds so I'll give them a pass there and you know what I'll break it next time next meet I'll officially break it I mean, realistically, some dust could have fell on the bar, plus the chalk in my hands probably was 700, but it's officially 699.9, so I'll leave it there. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate all the support through my whole journey. Although my road to nationals is ending, there is some opportunity for international meets coming up, so stay tuned. Might have some exciting news if I get onto one of the national teams for one of those meets. So. If you haven't already, please subscribe, like and share, it means a ton to me. Get Cap It, and I will catch you next time.